Alright, I'm doing my test. The, the electricist been doing between the, the super wash so washing soda and borax. Don't know, is so, did my video earlier on just the electrosis with the washing soda came out good. Basically, just doing a side by side comparison of what they'll look like. These are my two scrap pieces. I'm putting in these for the rest to go to. I had to find some two things that were basically the rusted as much as they were. I found had a couple old splitting wedges for wood. They're pretty well rusted. They're just sitting around, so that's why I'll go ahead and use these. They're about the same. I'm gonna try and mix everything to be about the same. Put them both in. All I have is just a just a piece of metal with a clothes hanger connecting the two pieces for the terminals. I don't know how this is gonna work, but we'll find out. Alright. They're both in the water. Not real far, but enough to they're gonna have an effect. I said in the other video, for about five gallons of water, you want to use about a cup, or a cup and a half to a cup of the washing soda. Since I'm nowhere even close to that amount, is I'm just pouring it in. And that should be a pretty good amount for it. Now the borax, do the same thing. This I had for supposed to be flex welding on steel and everything for forging stuff. I never once used it, so I just never had a reason to. I never tried flux welding yet. I'm not that far into my forging stuff. So I've had it for probably about two years. Side, so I don't know which one is which. Now, take my battery charger, same one that I had before. It's a small one. I used got it at Walmart, just something cheap. You can use it. I got it at Walmart for it's used for motorcycles, mopeds, ATVs, just small battery things. Just hook the battery. Negative, go to the pieces that you're wanting to remove the rust from. Positive to the ones that you're wanting to put it to. Then plug it in. Mine doesn't have the on-off switch like I said in the other video, so it doesn't affect the same way. I don't have an on-off switch, so I just plug it straight in. As soon as it's in, it goes. Now... I just plugged it in and you can already see with just with the bore or the washing soda you can already see a chemical reaction going the borax there's a slight one going but I'm gonna let it sit for a while let it go for probably about 15 minutes or so come back check it All right, this is about Five to ten minutes afterwards, I added a little bit more water just so I can just see get where it's actually up more on the steel. You can clearly see the right side. It's the washing soda. You can see the what all that's doing. It's it's coming off real good. It's got. It's, the chemical reaction is going strong. On the borax side, you can kind of see a little bit of an effect coming off. Not a whole lot, not nearly as much, but there is some. But I'll come back probably about another hour from now, see how it's doing, just so we can compare it some more. I'll know the water, as much as the 
washing soda is doing, it's definitely going to, water is going to be a lot filthier, foggier. I'll see it then. All right, back out here. It's probably a little over an hour. To an hour and a half. An hour. Not a whole lot has been done. You can kind of tell. This is the borax. It has got a little bit of a, a foamy film to it. The bubble going around the on the scrap piece. Not a whole lot. It's got a darker shade to it. Thinking most likely it's because of the rust. Just kind of fading it. And the washing soda. And it, you can easily see it's still working. It's affecting the whole thing pretty good. You can you can see the it's just a little bit of debris inside of it. How much it's actually agitating the water and circulating it. And it's not it's going pretty good. It's got the film going around the edge of it, unlike the other one. So we'll come back in another hour, somewhere between an hour, two hours again. See how it is. Let's see how that one goes for it. Alright, back again, probably about an hour and a half later. You can tell there is still stuff going on. You can see some of the film, foam starting to build up just on the borax side. Still kind of a dark color. You can't see much re reaction going on. There is a little bit because the water is kind of circulating around. Then washing soda it's going just the same as it always or it was last time i looked but it's actually gotten a lot more film going around it still still putting off a lot try to for its cleaning it's going across that whole the whole wedge so even the scrap metal it's still kind of, it's reacting just as much so this is definitely going to be a, a long process, multiple hours, so this is all I'm going to be able to do for a while is just go back and forth, gradually check on it. So I'll come back again, see where that where it's at then. Alright, now I'm back at it. Probably went, so I know I went more than two hours, probably closer to three hours without even looking at it. Is, like I said in the last video I did, I didn't, I don't like leaving stuff overnight, and so I'm just gonna go ahead and take it out and see what a few hours sitting in it might have done. As you can see the washing soda is doing a lot more. As it's developed a wider way, uh, a bigger thing of foam on top, but it's still cleaning even though. It's doing pretty good. If you can see, it's a little hard underneath it at the very bottom. You can actually see a bunch of just like black pieces that have fallen off. And the borax, it's done more too. It keeps making more foam. There is still a chemical reaction going on, but not much. It's, so I'm just going to go ahead and just take everything out, wipe it off see what it actually looks like. I can compare it with what what was outside the water compared to what was in it and see how much it actually cleaned. So I'm just gonna unplug it. Right, touch it.
Now this one didn't turn out too bad for borax. This is the piece that the rust was going to. You can tell there is a pretty decent build up on it from what was going. Now this This wood isn't too bad. Did pretty decent. It still collected what it needed to. You can just rub it right off. Yeah, but that's how it turned out. It didn't even have the, the result that I was expecting. I really thought the washing soda was going to be a better thing. But it looks like the borax actually was a front front runner for it all. I didn't expect. So that concludes this video. Remember, just hit the like, subscribe, even comment if you want. I'll get try to answer anything, any questions. As, other than that, wait for my next video, which I still don't even know what it's going to be, but it should be interesting. Thanks.